Let us evaluate the limit of function cos 2x minus 1 over x squared when x approaches 0. Now, if you remember, what is cos 2x equals to? Cos 2x is equals to 2 cos square x minus 1. It is also equals to 1 minus 2 sin square x, right? And we have one more formula for this, which is cos square x minus sin square x. So these are the three formulas which can be used with cos 2x. In this case, we have cos 2x minus 1. So we'll prefer to apply 1 minus 2 sin square x. In that case, 1 and 1 will cancel out. We'll have 2 sin square x and x square in the denominator will help us find the limit. Since we know limit for x approaching 0 of sin x over x is actually 1. So we'll use this and get our answer. So that is the strategy behind the solution. So let's do that. So we can write this limit as limit x approaching 0. Cos 2x we are writing as 1 minus 2 sin square x. We get 1 minus 2 sin square x. Well, some of you who want, they can pause the video, write down the solution and then check the answer. So we are writing cos 2x as 1 minus 2 sin square x and then we have minus 1 over x square. Now this can be written as limit x approaching 0. 1 minus 1 is 0. So we have minus 2 sin square x over x square, right? Now I can write this minus 2 is a constant. So let me bring it outside and we say limit x approaching 0. And what do we have here? We have sin x over x whole square, right? Now limit of sin x over x is actually 1. So we can write this as minus 2. And within bracket, we'll write limit x approaches 0 for sin x over x whole square. You see that? Now this is 1 and therefore we get our answer which is minus 2. And therefore we can write that this limit is equals to minus 2. So that is how we are going to solve it. Thank you.